Now we are to learn about how to answer word integer questions. So I am interested to see three steps for the word question. Number one, you are to draw something about it. Draw something, you won't make a mistake here. Anything, any draw related to the question, it will be okay. And then do the math that you've been practicing so you are ready for it. And then the sentence, whatever is the question asking you, give me a sentence about it. So let's do an example. So we have a word question here. In this question, it tells us that the temperature at the ground level was 20 degree and the pilot reported that it is on the, uh, at 10,000 feet above, it is minus 25 degree, it's colder. So the question is, uh, the t how much the temperature dropped? So that's the question. Number one, draw. So let's just draw about this situation. And the question is talking about airport. Let's just make an airport here. Those are the windows. And let's just say airport. And the pilot reports the temperature at 25, minus 25 degree, 10,000 kilometers above the ground level. So let's just make a plane here. It's very ugly, but that does give the idea. It works. Let's just make clouds here. Perfect drawing. So I just did that drawing. That's fine. And now I'm going to do the math. How I'm going to do the math. Before I do the math, let me tell you this. Today, um, I realized that the temperature in my house is 20 degree. And this afternoon, I realized that it is 15 degree. So, how much the temperature dropped here? So, you know that the difference is 5 degree here. But how you calculate that? So, before it was 20 and now it's 15. Simply, you just do the subtraction, right? From the first one to the second one, you do the subtraction. And you will end up with 5. And you're going to say... 5 degree, your uh, your to room, the temperature has changed. So that will be right. It's no different with this question. So with this question, the temperature first at the ground level noted that it's 20 degree. So let's write down 20. And you know that I'm going to do the subtraction here, right? So let's do the subtraction. Now let's check the next number. Whatever that number is, if it's 15, I'm going to write down 15. If it's 10, I'm going to write down 10. But if it is minus 25, I am to write down the minus 25 here. Let's write down minus 25. Ignore what we did before. I need to write down minus 25 here. So let's write it down. Minus 25. Okay, now I see two negative signs standing next to each other from our previous work. Now you know that two negative signs next to each other means simply addition. So the math we are supposed to be doing here is 20 plus 25, which is 45. That's it. That's the math about this question. And now... I did the drawing. This is the math I just did. Sentence. That's the last one. Sentence. Let's just copy our sentence from the question here. How much did the temperature drop? So it's the past tense here. I'm going to make sure I have the past tense at my, um, at my answer here. So I'm going to say the temperature dropped 45 degree. That will be good enough. Let's write this down. The temperature dropped 45 degrees. Done.